Rush and grammar's complicated Bridges drive you mad Verbs require conjugation And nouns are just as bad Ruski <laughs> out of here with a lesson all about cars and things related to cars. First of all, let's be clear on one thing. There are two words in Russian that mean car, and these words would be machina and automobile. And with that little detail taken care of, let's get straight to our first sample sentence. On davno na uchelsia vadits machino. It means he learned to drive a car long ago. The word of interest in this sentence is vadits, which means to drive or to lead. Interestingly, there are two other forms of vadits that exist. While vadits is considered to be the indefinite imperfective aspect, vesti is the definite imperfective aspect, and povesti is the perfective form. Our second sample sentence goes like this. Mui priyehalif shkulo na automobili. It means we rode to school in a car. Priyehali is the word to focus on here. It means to arrive or to come by vehicle. Priyehali is a past tense form of priyehats for your information. And now for sample sentence number three. On dolgen buil pont minyat shino. It means he had to change a tire. The focus word here is shino, which is a form of shina, which means tire. By the way, Omenya spustilo shino and omenya spustili shino both mean I have a flat tire. And which one you should use depends on your exact set of circumstances. And now moving on to sample sentence four. Benzo bak pachti pust. It means the gas tank is almost empty. The word to focus on here is pust, which is a short form of pustoi and which means empty. And finally we have Yivo akumu lator seal, yimu nujan nuvui. It means his battery is dead, he needs a new one. Literally, yivo akumu lator seal means his battery sat down. But that's the idiom used in Russia to explain to someone that a battery no longer has any electrical charge left. Also, it should be pointed out that another word for battery in Russian is bateria. But the focus word here is akumulator nevertheless. To further complicate things, accumulator stach is another way to say that a battery is dead and that it can't be recharged anymore. Which leads us to another variation of the above example. Yivu accumulator seal, yimu nujna pad jaryadka. It means his battery is dead, it needs recharging. If we had said accumulator stach, then it would not be possible to recharge the battery. The entire list of focus words for this lesson goes like this. Vaditz means to drive. Priyahas means to arrive by vehicle. Shina means tire. Pustoi means empty. And Akumulator means battery. Ruski is signing off now. Das vid on ya! Russian grammar is complicated. I just drive you mad. Verbs require conjugation. Nouns are just as bad.